Hey, I'm Mark Cleaver for Producer White of the Student Drama Moving In. The video you're about to see is an audience preview of the second episode of the series. The point of the release of this video is to get your opinion so far of the episode before we shoot for the second part. So if you don't understand anything, you feel the characters need a better introduction, or there's something you feel needs making clear about the story, please comment on this video in the comment section, but please be constructive and if possible, provide an example of how you would improve things. Thank you very much and I hope you enjoy the latest instalment of Moving In. You want to come to uni? I was thinking I might take a gap year. I'm afraid I won't be able to go to uni because of my, my Asperger syndrome. So, did Mum tell you? What? Sarah's moving in, if she accept. I feel like I'm being pushed out of this place. I think for this family it'd be good if you did go to uni. Excellent, well I found you some good student accommodation. Do you want to go see? Yeah, I can't wait. What's it like inside? It's Freshers' Week. I've got to get a group together. I may have to cut Freshers' Week short. My brother could be getting engaged. My brother's girlfriend said yes. I'm afraid I'm going to have to give Freshers a miss this year. It's just starting to feel settled here as well. It'll be your engagement party someday. They made my mother cry. presidential campaign, you sure are one of the main candidates and you find time to meet me. I'm honoured. Is there a reason we can have met at my place? It's five minutes from here. I don't do house calls. You come to me. You have an idea on how to make him lose then? Well, Michael's presidential campaign is over once you give me to go ahead. I need more time. So I change your mind? I'm not sure if I'm ready to do this to a friend, let alone a housemate. Last met and friend. Plot thickens. Give me two days. If you want to win this, you know where to find me. What have we got here? Looks like an early birthday present. Look, I, I don't want any trouble, I just want to get home safe now. Sounds like a good idea, but first, give me your wallet. Are you serious? Give us your wallet and your phone. What? Now. My phone is a brick. It's not literally, but it's good. I don't answer. care. It's better than mine. Mine's a pebble. <laughs> Amy? What? You can answer the phone or not? Yeah, yeah. Michael, uh, what's up? Just wondering whether you're still up for buying wifey something special at Gunwolf. Uh, hold, hold on, Gunwolf? And did you say wifey? Look here, Rory. I'm the sarcastic one between us. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll just check with um. Go seriously. When have you ever had to check with me before? It's why we work so well together. We trust each other. Uh, uh okay, Michael. I'll see you in an hour. Great. Make sure you bring your credit card. He sounds so confident. I know. It's amazing what love will do to a person. Have you forgotten something? Have you got your 
a book published. I know. Are you sure we can't just have a quieter celebration tonight? You know, the core four, like it usually is. But you've got a published book. Go and get dressed. I don't want you to delay getting my present any longer. Come on, it's obvious what you and Michael are doing. Just promise me you won't spend too much. Yeah, sure. I know you have the money, but... I do. But I like to think we don't have to live on money. Yeah, uh, any, anything you want. I mean, I remember our first date. You're dead. My... No. No, son. You're very much alive. Thank God. But what's happening? Is, is this a dream? No, son. This is your life. I know how impossible it must seem. But you, you've got to be joking. This can't be. I'm married to Amy. But everything's possible. If the choices you make are the right ones. Choices? What choices? I walk the town, I really walk the show Blow my mind, I'm on the radio I'll keep it up, I'll keep it in, I'll keep it all night long Who can stop me when I sing this song? What are you cooking? Fish fingers. M Michael likes them. I'm not exactly pulling out all the stops for this presidential party. Well, if Michael wants Nigella Lawson for his party, then he'll have to organise better next time. Why are you happy him anyway? Are you interested in him? Th that's a pretty forward question. Just making sure you know whose boyfriend he is. Okay, I think that's done. What do you think, Michael? Very nice. Still not so sure about the take a hike bit. Uh, sometimes you've got to play hardball with people. Thanks for the birthday present, by the way. It was okay. That's okay. As long as you say you prefer me to Harrison Ford. <laughs> that's just cruel. You feel me to lie to you, do you? I'm just joking. Hello, Grant. Say hi to her for me. Yeah, sure. I'll see you in a sec. Rory Jones, are you there? Grab my hand if you can hear me. You've forgotten your keys. My keys. Car keys? I have a car. Yes. Thank God you do. Please don't let Michael peer pressure you into the pub on the way back. Why not? Come on, you've been five years without alcohol now. If it hadn't been for that incident, and if your mum hadn't stopped bailing you out, then... We probably wouldn't be here.
I knew from the moment I met you. Tess, I knew. What did I know? Jesus. How did you come up with your vows? Uh, brainstorming at AA meeting. It's all so expensive in here. Exactly. You've got real money now to buy a proper wedding ring. That's why we're here, isn't it? You two are together. Why well, so surprised? You got back together on your wedding day. Yeah, I, I know. It's, it's just good to see you two together. You're not drunk again, are you? No, I've been having Michael out. Is that how the vows come in? I've got to you. That's not all of it, is it? <laughs> Best man speech, bro? Right? Bit better than Michael. Look, all these stories, it's not all about racing it, you know. It's all about publicity for you too, isn't it? So, um, you found a ring? That's the one. You have to give that one to Amy. Whoa! We're all here waiting for this new life to begin. Whoa! Don't know one another, but we're all still moving in.